Hey, 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 everybody. It's a Wednesday. Happy hump day, guys. Wednesday night at 9 p.m. September 27th, 2023. This month is almost over. What's going on, guys? I missed you earlier today, but here I am. Welcome back, everybody. Tonight, we're looking into the new documents that came out through Idaho. And we're going back to Delphi, back to the beginning. All the way back to the beginning. I'm glad to be here with you guys. So glad to see you all. Thank you so much for joining us. Let's do this, folks. Let's get this show on the road. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, welcome back. What's up, Mama Bear? How are you? I'm good. How are you? I am wonderful. Oh, it's dark there. It is. Spooky. I got my, <laughs> I got my fake fireplace going in the background. Oh, I, I see that. That's on my TV. I was trying to figure out something to have for the background. Hey, I see you. <laughs> well, that one looks just like you. You there? I'm here. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> anyway, um, <clears throat> welcome back, everybody. Are you guys having an okay day, Bear? Yeah, it wasn't too bad. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I mean, I, I know you guys had a little bit of a thing, so I just want to make sure everybody's okay. Yep, we're okay. better. Good, 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 good. Mm -hmm. um, I'm glad she's okay. You're okay. We're okay. Mm -hmm. No, you guys are okay. Yeah. So thank you for joining me tonight. This special occasion we get Mama Bear in the evening time. Hey, J Rod, how are you? So let's see, guys. Again, real quick, we're going over the uh, new documents in Idaho, of course. And with everything that's been going on, guys, we're going to be jumping back to the beginning at Delphi. And looking at some things, uh, we did a little show about it the other day. And at this point, there's some other things that I want to go back and relook at the videos, do this and do that. So whoever's on board for that, here we are. <clears throat> but before we get to that, folks, very sadly, we have to have a conversation 
once again, as much as I hate having these conversations, there's always a reason to do it. Uh, but before I do that, I want to welcome everybody. That's the first thing we'll get into, though. We'll get that out of the way and move forward. So it looks like we got Kalida Hope back in the house. Welcome back, Hope. Good to see you. Miss Carolyn Oss Miller, welcome. Great to see you, the Canadian cat lady. Welcome back, dear. Lisa and Cannoli, always happy to see you. Miss Zelda, can you hear me, by the way? Yes, okay. loud and clear. I forgot to check it. Um, Miss Zelda, by the way, welcome back. Rock Chalk's in the house. What's going on? Good to see you. What is happening? J-Rod, on point in the house, everybody. What's going on, J-Rod? How you doing, brother? Good to see you. Uh, Miss Brady B, the OG. By the way, J-Rod, I appreciate the support, brother. 100%. Uh, Steve Materna, great to see you. Great to have you here. I still can't get over how great this looks, you guys. Every day I look at this, it's still brand new to me. Like, <laughs> crazy. Jay Litz in the house. Great to see you. The lovely Miss Sherry from Wisdom Speaks. Great to see you. Uh, great to have you here. Ronnie Potter, welcome back. Great to have you. Katie Quarters, always a pleasure to see you. Dad, Gigi Lights in the house. Welcome back, Gigi. Great to see you. Miss Jacqueline Keeley, good to see you. That's not a real fire. <laughs> it's, my, it's one of those screensaver things for your TV. That's my other Den TV going there. I didn't put up my green screen yet. It's pretty cool, though. I like that. Um, yeah, that is cool. Danger Zones in the house. What's going on? And good golly, good golly, golly, golly. Miss Molly's in the house. Good to see you, Molly. Thank you for being here, darling. Let's see. Let's see. Who do we have? Tina B, welcome back, dear. Good to see you. Come on in, guys. Grab a seat. If you will, make sure you're leaving that DNA on the like button. As you're coming through the door, I would really appreciate it. And please behave, because the Karma Police are in the house, folks. Great to see you, Karma. Thank you for joining us tonight. All right, let me see who else we have here. Do, 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 do. Flame Crown. Hey, it does kind of look like it's on top of my head, doesn't it? <laughs> All right. Thank you, Miss Carolyn. Let me see. Let me see. Gotcha, 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 J-Rod. Sherlock, Kendra, thank you for joining us. I hope you sent that, what you sent to me earlier, Kendra, to my email, if you will. That's perfect for what we're going to be talking about. Miss Jilly Beans in the house. Welcome back, dear. Good to see you. Ray Balduck. Welcome back, dear. Jesse Lynn's in the house. Elizabeth Munster. I love your name. That's awesome. Hey, Jennifer. We can see you. Miss Salty Sluice in the house. Great to see you. Firefly. Welcome back, lady. Good to see you, dear. Great to have you here. Jennifer <laughs> S. Always happy to see you. <laughs> what? Cooking a old cat on my... Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I had to look at that twice like, what? Wait, what? Yeah, I, I did you. too. I was like, what? He's I got you, bro. Oh, What? Yep, right? <laughs> good stuff, good stuff. Miss Joanne's in the house. What's going on, Miss Joanne? Great to see you. Thank you so much for being here. Mikey, my brother Mike, what's going on, buddy? Good to see you. <laughs> that was good, J-Rod. That was good. All right, all right. Miss Pisces, it's been a minute. Great to see you. Great to have you here. <clears throat> Come on in, guys. Grab your coffee, tea, whatever that may be. Got my coffee. Come on in. Sit down. Have a conversation with Mama Bear and me, if you will. Mama Bear may not be here the whole time, but she's going to be here for a little bit. Um, just a little bit. Sooner Girl, welcome back. I look twice, too, thinking about <laughs> Right. <laughs> That was funny. That was funny. Come on in, everybody, if you will. Find a seat. Great to see you guys. I missed you guys today and last night. I'm so sorry. Uh, not everybody was feeling good last night. We had some doctor's appointments today, so on and so forth. But we are here. Yes. And I am going to be making these nighttime things a regular thing. Like I said, I've been trying. There's been so much going on lately with all this moving things and building things and doing things and all this other stuff, all of that. But it's going to happen, folks. 
The nighttime streams are a regular, at least three days a week, like I said. We'll be getting back on our regular, regularly scheduled programming, I like saying that. Thank you, Miss Wisdom. Guys, if you're not familiar with or have not checked out yet, please go and check out J-Rod on Point. Our man J-Rod's in chat right now. There's the link right there. Miss Wisdom just shared it. Please go check it out. Show some love, if you will, for me, please. Subscribe and check it out. You won't be disappointed. I, I promise you won't. <laughs> Absolutely not. No. J-Rod. J-Rod. Yeah. He is. He's a funny guy, too. I'll tell you that much. Dude's got a <laughs> yeah. hilarious sense. He's on a roll tonight. <laughs> yes, he is. Dana Renee, good to see you, dear. Rissa Roberts, welcome back, darling. Good to see you as well. All of this green, all of these meatballs. I'm so happy to see you all. Thank you so much for jumping on in this sauce tonight as we spill a little bit here and a little bit there. All right, all right, all right. Who else we got? Anybody new? We got 88 peeps in here, guys. 43 likes. You know what I'm going to say next. Cryptic Conversions, welcome. Good to see you. It's about time. I know it is. I'm sorry. We had <laughs> dual doctor's appointments today. We had this. We had that. We had all sorts of stuff. <clears throat> Zoe Hall, great to see you. Thanks for joining us from Australia, Melbourne. How about that? Another Aussie in the house. I love the Aussies and the UKers. That's a fact. I'll take a hard pass on that request. Sorry, Dago. Uh, which which request did I? Which one? Okay. Anyone seen no James? Nope. And I will explain to you why. Hello, Daisy. Daisy dead. Welcome, welcome. That's what we got to talk about, folks. And that's sadly what it's all about. At least the. The first few minutes of what we're doing here. <clears throat> I just wanted to make sure everybody's in. Most everybody, at least. Yep. Because sadly, once again, I find myself having to defend myself against something that people are out making up things and telling lies again. It's that partial lies. I should say partial lies. And I'll tell you why here in a minute. Um... Coco, in the house. Good to see you. Thank you for being here. Appreciate you. And I don't know why. That's the sad part. The thing that bothers me, I had conversations with a lot of people today. Thank you, Miss Zoe. I appreciate you. Or is it Zoe or Zoe? I appreciate that. I, I don't like to mispronounce people's names. Um, but sadly, um, people I found... Holly Link is in the chat. Sorry. Since we've been in YouTube land here, they go looking for information. And when they get it, they take it and have a tendency to twist it all up into a dreadlock, as I'll call it. Because it's dreadful, some of the things that come out of it. Yes. And cause try to cause problems for people where they shouldn't. You know, and the thing that I've noticed is happens is a long time it's people that it's always people that I have a tendency to care about because I care about everybody, guys. I care about people. All of you guys are so very important to me. Pronounce the E. And, okay, I got you, Zoe. Thank you. Um, And it's happened to me before. You guys know that. It's happened to me a couple different times. What's up, Blah? Um, And Katie Quarters. If I didn't say hi, I said hi. Um, Oh, okay. We got here. Looks like Miss Molly's in the house. Thank you for joining us, Molly. Good to see you, dear. Can you hear Hi, us? Sweetheart. Maybe not yet. She's probably getting her headset together. So, where was I? Um, Hello. There, there she is. is. <laughs> so, that's, that's, you know, Zoe, that's a point there, and it's very sad, because I am always the one. You guys that have been here for a while, you know who I am, how I am, and the way I am with people. What's up, Robert Bell? Good to see you, brother. And so, I am constantly reaching out to people, giving people a place to be, to, be, to try to feel comfortable, to try to be safe, in a sense, from other people that just don't. Thank you, Wisdom. I appreciate that, dear. Uh, that just don't treat them the right way, 
you know, and I've always been that guy and that person. And I always will be. That's just who I am. It's my personality. And I'm not changing it. Okay. Um, <clears throat> so what's up, laughing stock? Good to see you, brother. Um, hey, Molly, Molly. Thank you for joining us tonight, dear. Um, okay, Gigi. Um, no problem. So here we go. I'm going to pull a Dago here and forget where I was. Um, Miss Heather's in the house. Thank you for joining us, Heather. Good to see you, dear. Um, <laughs> hold on a minute, guys. I'll get it back. <laughs> Every time. I hate it. Sorry. Sorry. Miss Kate or CJ, good to see you, dear. And sir, and I love that you love the channel. We love you, too. Miss Brandy B, the OG Paris girl, good to see you. All right, so back to where I was. <clears throat> we do have 100 peeps in here now with 63 likes, and I thank you all for that. Let's, let's try to make a match, guys, for the important part of the show. The Richard, what's up? So anyway, back to where I was. And this is why I do believe tonight we have <clears throat> Mama Bear. Hi. In the evening, we don't get her. There's a reason. Rowena mm -hmm. Moses, great to see you. And Molly never goes on panel, but there's a reason. This is... Yep. This is to prove to you guys. <laughs> well, this proves to you and myself. I already knew this, but and Mikey's here as always. The support that I have and the support group that I've always had um, that support me through everything I've been through along with you guys. Okay. And it, you're right, Cryptic. You are absolutely right. <laughs> yep. 100%. Thank Love you, you too, J Mikey. Thank you, J-Rod. I appreciate that, my brother. I'm just trying to make sure I get everything right and get everything out. So, as I was saying, I'm constantly reaching out to people that have had problems in other, I guess you could say other channels, this, that, everything else. My doors are always open to everybody. I allow people to come into this community. I, I only ask a few things, and that's just a res really one thing, and that's just to respect each other. Yeah. I've always said... I don't even need you to respect me, which I get argued with by these two mostly, but <clears throat> so on and so forth. So thank you, uh, Dana. I appreciate that. So again, I did it again. And and I wear my heart right here, folks, on both sides. Always have. Yep. Uh, I'm a very, um, Tammy, good to see you. I'm not being fancy. I just wanted to give you guys something other than a TV to look at. <laughs> but thank you for joining us. So anyway, I trust people. Uh, Miss Heather's been with me for two years. She's in here right now. We go back and forth like brother and sister. She's always telling me, without saying it, because she's too nice to do that, that I'm being a dipshit and I trust people too much, <laughs> too, quick, too fast, and too far. She's right. I've had to apologize to Heather I don't know how many times because she's been right. I had to do it again. Anyway, so there's been some people that have come in here. I made them uh, an important part of the community because I felt that they were important people. I very much cared for these people, so on and so forth. I still at this point don't know what happened, but they decided to go digging in my business and look into my, my life and so on and so forth. Everybody has their lives, their personal business. I've never really ever hidden anything from anybody i've always been real with you guys okay always been real with you guys about who i am you guys know my name you know how old i am you know where i live you know my family period because that's who i like to be i like to be real so um everybody knows i have seven children i've talked about that too well my oldest child is a male he has my name my namesake i guess you call that Okay, other than a couple of letters because his mother was strange and decided to change it. That's irrelevant. <laughs> and <clears throat> the point is, is um, my son is in prison. He's 30 years old. He's in prison. He was accused of something that there is not and nor has been ever found any evidence of other than hearsay. I had not seen my son, my oldest son, and that's another reason why these two wonderful ladies are here, because they've known about this, as do quite a few other of my moderators that I'm very close with. They know about this. 
and it's it's not something I've ever hidden nor lied about. It's something that I just don't talk about because I'm not proud of it. Okay. Um, most of our children we love, and I do love my son. I love my son with all of my heart. I'm very disappointed in him to an extent because I don't know the truth on part of this, okay? But my son is in prison. He was accused of something. There was no physical proof. There were multiple things done in that situation that you would do in a case that's in that way, as we all know, being in true crime. And there was never any proof found ever other than word of mouth. Uh, he was accused of doing something to a minor 12, 13 year old girl. Um, he, uh, I was, I was, I guess, what's the word estranged from him for three years before that ever happened. I hadn't spoken to him in three years because he also had a very bad drug habit, um, very sadly. And I tried to help him multiple years before that with it. He had an addiction to meth. Very bad one. And I have a 17 year old child here at that time. He was, you know, 12, 13 years old. And I said, enough is enough. I cannot have you in my life with this child because it, it's, I don't know what you're going to do. Um, we, they go, we want you to what? Everything Richard said. What is that? I don't understand what that means. Where is it? Oh, he says, we or I don't want you to share everything, but okay, I'm concerned about safety. Just your safety and putting everything out there, I think is what he's trying to say. Hmm. Are you still there? Uh-oh. Did he freeze? Uh, yeah, I think we just lost him. I wasn't sure if it was him or if it was me. <laughs> Rutro. <laughs> right. <laughs> Rutro, Raggy. Do, we need, do I need to sing my song? Dago. Dago. What did, what is it? They go. See, I'm so tired. <laughs> this is why I'm not on right <laughs> She's goofy when she's tired. It's fun. It's fun. Nope. I think it's him. <laughs> there he is. Hi. Welcome back. Oh, oh just kidding. I, oh. Uh, it never Hi. Peekaboo. With this stupid <laughs> internet, it never, ever fails. <laughs> We're playing peekaboo. Hurry up and get through this while I right. can, because God knows what's going to happen. <laughs> anyway, so thank this, you, Pisces, for joining the members. Welcome back here, and again, thank you guys for. Um, I see that everybody's already saying nice comments on and so forth, but I wanted to come out myself before. What is going on with me? Why do I look like that? Hold on. Before it, 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 somebody tries to, to make more lies that have already been stated. Lies have been put out there about this situation, okay? That's the truth. Now, it's been being spread round and round and round that I'm doing my live streaming just to make money to support my son in prison. That's not true. Not one, not, not one iota of truth goes to that. I was doing this before my son was arrested and or went to prison, okay? And I'm sorry that I have to give my business like this to you guys. Nobody probably wants to hear this. And it's embarrassing. And I'm upset about this, okay, that I have to do this. But I'm doing it because I've always been real with you guys. And I will never hide anything from you guys, okay? <clears throat> Again, I did not not talk about it to hide it. I did not not talk about it to be dishonest. I didn't talk about it because I'm not proud of it, okay? But at the same time, there was never any... Thank you, J-Rod. I, I absolutely appreciate that, bro. <laughs> you have no idea. <clears throat> I'm sorry. 
Sorry. Breathe. It's okay. We got you, dude. <clears throat> okay. Hold on. Are you okay? Sorry, my wife is a distraught mess about this too because Yeah. It's wrong. Okay. And it's pretty wrong. People are saying whatever they can say about me because for whatever reason, and I don't understand coming from the people that it's coming from, that I've heard it coming from, because I've done nothing but stand up for these people, go to bat for these people, defend these people about, against multiple people that were attacking them. That's all I've ever done. That's all I've ever done. That's all I've ever wanted to do is to help people. And this is what I've gotten in return for it, okay? <clears throat> Excuse me. Now, that's it, folks. That's the big bombshell right there, okay? Um, I don't send money to this, my, my son, from doing this. I, 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 every donation that I've gotten, especially over the past month, I, I think roughly, has gone into this right here. It pays my stream yard. It pays my internet. It pays my my YouTube premium. It plays it recently. It's bought me this new amazing system because of the amazing people that donated for that to keep me doing this because they know the passion I have for this and the love that I have for everybody in here. And I absolutely, absolutely. I love and adore every one of you people more than I could ever put into words for supporting me the way that you guys have again and again and again and again. And every time I start to feel as if society is still is becoming good again, okay? For lack of better terms, I can't think of it. <clears throat> I get smacked in the face again. I would never lie to any of you. I never have. I never will. I've told you everything about my life. Not that I should have to, but I chose to. Okay? Because I wanted to be real with you guys. So... Unfortunately, I had to bring my personal life, my personal business, and throw it in your guys' space. That's not why you're here. You're not here to know that about me. You're not here to want to hear that about me, okay? Just as much as I don't want to know that about you guys. You know, this is supposed to be a, a safe place, a good place, a nice place to be. And, 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 and that's why I've made this like this. Hey, Heather, good to see you, sis. Thank you for being here. <clears throat> and again, that's it. That's what it is. So no, I don't come out here grifting to make money to give my son in prison, who, again, I was estranged from for three years before he even was arrested, which was a year, two years ago. And he went to prison a year and a half ago, I think it was. That's not what I do. And I do. I love my child. I love my son. I'm very disappointed in his situation. But <clears throat> it is what it is. I have no control over you. He's a 30 year old man. A 30 year old man. I don't know if it happened. Again, there was never any evidence found, there was never anything ever there. And from what I understand, he was basically scared into a plea bargain. He was told, basically, you're going to spend the rest of your life in prison if you don't say this. He had never been through anything like that, never knew anything about that. He had a public defender. That was it. So he didn't know. 
Nobody in our family had any money. Nobody knew. I didn't even know about this until it was too late. He didn't have the money to buy a real attorney. So this is where it's at. So again, yes, my son's in prison. He was accused of something that nobody, he says he didn't do. <clears throat> he swears to God he didn't do. But that's it, folks. That's it. That's the deep, dark secret that the people that I have supported and tried to help and tried to be there for and tried to stand up against bad and, and nasty people for are slinging about me right now for whatever reason. That's the big bad secret. It wasn't a secret. Just something I wasn't proud of and didn't think it was really anybody's business. So that's why I never told you guys about it. But here it is. That's it. Right hand to God, folks, and nothing more. Now, I'm going to say something else. I'm not going to be... I'm not going to change who I am, folks. I'm not. But I'm going to tell you one other thing. Heather has been with me for two years. She knows me just as much as Mama Bear, Molly, and Mikey know me. They know me better than I know myself. Okay? Th these people tell me to take my medications. They tell me to do this. They tell me to do that. They know what's going on with me when I'm not right. Okay? So, Heather was right. Heather was right. Heather's been right. Hey, Heather. My sister again. Thank you for being here, hon, to support me. I appreciate you. That's my biological sister right there, folks. My baby sister. She's amazing, too, just like the rest of my family. Um, <clears throat> Of course, except for that one child of mine that's in prison, like I said. So, anyway, that's that. Um, That is the person that... that told other people coco it was told to me blatantly and then um there's somebody else that's in here that was doing it too and i i'm not i'm not even gonna say a word well aj i don't know <laughs> thank you bud but i'm not i'm not i'm not the person to start slinging bad words or or saying bad things about these people Whatever the reasoning was that these people feel that they need to do this, they have a reason. So be it. Yep. I'm done with it. That's And I'm, I'm going to say this right now. I won't talk about it again. It won't come up in conversation. I won't answer any more questions about it. I mean, I, I will personally if there's another question, but that's it. Okay? I'm not my son. Exactly. I don't control a 30-year-old man. Because believe me, if I could, I would. But again, I don't even know what the deal was. What happened? Didn't happen. I don't know. Nobody does other than those people. Okay? He says it didn't happen. As do most people that do things. I know that's going to be said. Everybody says they didn't do it. See it. Whatever. Anyway, this is the last time that the conversation is going to be had. Um, if people have specific questions, I will answer a couple questions here and there. That's it. I'm not, it's part of my life. It's not part, and it wasn't part of my life. And it's not going to be part of my life. And it's not going to be part of this. Okay. That's it. I'm done with it. Um, you guys deserve to know because you support me. It is what it is. <clears throat> so, if anybody has any questions, you can privately ask me. That's right, Heather. We don't know. We never knew. It was a smack in the face one day. And a phone call. I think I was actually online when I got the phone call with, with you guys, wasn't I? Mm, I possibly, think, yeah. I, so and it was it, the phone call came from somebody completely different that saw it on the news i didn't even know sad but whatever so for whatever reasoning that the people did this i'm not going to sit here and slam those people i'm not going to sit here and try to figure out why it was done because i don't care i, I don't understand it. it and it's a it's a bad thing i agree with that 
But I will say this. These people right here, you people, Mama and and Molly and most definitely Heather and Sherry and Mikey and, and Brandy and all of these people. It's, it's behind me, Red. Don't, don't do that yet. I, I'm not ready to laugh yet, brother. It's right <laughs> behind me, though. Anyway, these are the people that make this happen every day. These are the people that when these things happen, they lift me up. You see that they're here. Mama Bear's never here at night. Molly's never up here, okay? This is why. This is why. This is this, yep. this, this, just hearing this. My wife's crying, okay? No, My youngest no. son is distraught, okay? Because they know that it hurts me. The only thing I can say is why people, it's, it's sick. If people want to hurt other people, guys, I don't get it. That's why I do what I do. But I'm not going to stew on it. I'm not because it's not worth it. You guys deserve better than that. That's right, bro. Ohio's strong, brother. 100%. Ohio's got some of the strongest people here. Nothing against everybody else, but we really do because we go through some shit, folks, and we come out on top every time. And we will continue to do that. Coco, we wouldn't be saying anything if we didn't have proof. We're not accusing anybody of it. It's not an accusation, hon. It's it's fact. It was said. J Rod could probably explain it to you. It it it's already been done, Coco. Way before I would have ever never done this. It it was said from that person's mouth. Yep. It was it was in more than one place. Multiple people have been approaching me over the past forty eight hours. Okay, uh, I just needed to make sure of it, and I wouldn't do that before I said something. Exactly. Uh oh, not again. Does he have a storm over there or anything? Um, I'm not sure. We had some here um, a few hours ago, probably about three or so hours ago. So they may be moving in over there because hmm. it would have been heading that direction, I believe. I'm not sure. Right. Though. Crappy. Yeah, pretty much. Um, let me see. <laughs> okay, let me look at the Where's my Hey, Popper, how are you, hon? Mm. Yeah, they might be having some storms up there. Okay. Yep. There we go. Hi. And, and we are, the wind's blowing like crazy. And yeah. <clears throat> thought so because we had them um, about i was telling molly about a couple hours or so ago two or yeah. three hours ago we had some storms come through so i figured they were headed that way well and that's the other thing is is i haven't cable hasn't come here yet to bring mm. the wire in to hardwire it to the the ah. so i'm running with one of those wi-fi extender things you know so Ew. my apologies everyone my apologies to all of you for that. But anyway, that's it, folks. That's what it is. There it is. I'm not going on about it. I'm not going to attack these people. I'm not going to talk bad about these people for whatever the reasoning is that they have. It, it is what it is. 
I'm done with it. It's over. I moved on. I'm moving on. Rock Chuck, there's no shame on you for asking where No Chains was. You shouldn't feel horrible. Not at all. Not, you had no yeah. idea. We yeah. didn't even know. Please don't feel bad. What's up, Popper? There's my brother. He didn't know. Yes, and while you dropped off, several people wanted you to send Caden and Mrs. Dago their love and let them know that we've got their back just as much. And thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, hey, Virginia, no, sir. Coco, you didn't get jumped, hon. Who jumped her for asking? When did that I happen? No, I didn't see that. She said she got jumped for asking what? Nobody was jumping anybody. We were just yeah. explaining to you that that that's not being jumped on. We were just explaining to you that, yes, we knew that's why I'm doing this. Okay, Molly, no problem, hon, and I appreciate that. I appreciate the support. You do what you got to do, darling. I appreciate you 1 million and, and 10%. And thank you, Zettel. I appreciate that as well. Universal. Very much so. All right, okay. let's see. Uh... Oh, I understand. I understand. <clears throat> oh, I'm so sorry, Terry. Of course. Of course, of course. And my condolences and prayers. Hey, is that Beaner or is that Groucho? That's Bean. I haven't seen you in a long time, buddy. <laughs> What's up, Bean Kitty Kitty Kitty? Damn. Um, 100% Terry, you're in our thoughts and prayers for sure, all of us. Uh, I want to thank everyone in here for their um, uh, their kind words and, and well wit, all of it, guys. All right, Molly, do your thing, sweetheart. Thank you again. Uh, you're very much appreciated. Thank you, Sherry. And a lot of people, I want you guys to understand Sinead. Okay, I've seen a lot of comments. People don't understand it, and I get it because you don't get it, okay? And it's not your fault. Sinead had a head injury. Okay. And that's why she talks like she does. That's why I give her the time to say what she has to say. And then the patience because she, that's the best she can do folks. She's very, very passionate, very heartfelt. She's a beautiful person. Mm -hmm. She has a beautiful soul. She's a very sweet, sweet lady. Uh, she's the lady that lives over in Ireland, but that's why she talks like that. So that's why I have the patience with her that I do as if I wouldn't anyway with anybody else. But for anybody that doesn't know about that, that's what it is. Okay. Uh, she doesn't drink or anything like that. I know a lot of people thought that she, she even said that she sounded drunk one time. I said, no, 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 <laughs> you're okay. You're okay. She struggles with oh. certain things and stuff like that. Plus she's Irish and certain words she tries to get out. It's harder for her to say. So mm -hmm. oh, we love her too. We adore her. Hello, Jennifer. Um, I'm looking here. Well, thank you, Rock Chalk. Um, uh, Jay Lit, thank you. Crime Silver, Solver, sorry. Uh, J Rod, specifically, my friend, I appreciate you, brother, very much, and the support. All about it, friend. All about it. Miss Brandy. Uh, everybody and everybody, any anybody and everybody in here, thank you for your kind words. No, I, I think you misconstrued that, Coco. Nobody was jumping you on. I was just trying to make sure you understood that we would have never made a statement like that, not knowing if it was true or not. Okay. Exactly. And so that's what it's all about. And that's it. I'm not going to talk. Like I said, those people won't be spoken about. That's it. It's done. I don't do that, guys. I don't trash people. I don't talk bad about other creators. Even if I don't care for them, I won't do it. You haven't heard me do it. I won't. And I don't talk bad about um, um, other people, even if they have things that, that they do. There are things that don't. I'm trying to think of the right terms. Just 
for whatever. There's no reason to. It doesn't make it any different. It doesn't change things. So that's what it is. You know what I mean? Yep. So that's it, folks. But anyway, thank you, Terry. I appreciate that very much. And J Rod, once again, thank you, brother. I appreciate you. Um, and Rock <laughs> Rock, thank you for that. Uh, I don't know about all of that, Mikey, but I appreciate it, bro. I really do. Um, <laughs> another fake log for fake fire. Thank you so much, Crime Solver, for that. I do that very much. I really do. Um, like I said, I didn't know what else I could do until I had the uh, uh, put up behind me, and I, I'm like, well, what the hell? You know, I have those those. Uh, screensaver things i figure what the hell it'd be kind of cool yeah um mm -hmm. and hey, that's listen, listen guys i'm gonna ask one thing from you guys whatever you guys do in your personal life is your business and i know ridiculous i'm to go out again <laughs> i don't want in here at least okay Please don't go crazy talking about these people exactly. or slamming them. It's not going to change it, guys. You guys can do what you do in your own personal life, but it's not going to change anything. Maybe it was, maybe, and hope it was just a misunderstanding on their part, but I don't think it was. But I, I'm just saying, don't, don't do it, guys. It's not worth it. It's not, it's not going to change it. It's not, just let it be what it is. I am. If I can do it, you can do it. Now, what you exactly. do with yourselves in your own place, it's up to you. You know what I mean? Being negative is nothing but bring us down. So we need to be. Right, opposite. guys. There's enough negativity. Way too much negativity. And I just, it's not enough. Thank you, Paris. I know. I, I know. I do. I'm beyond grateful for this team. Um, and the moderators I have, I just, I can't. The the mods, the, the rest of the, the, the team members. No, it's because it's dark filing. <laughs> you can't, the light's not flowing in my face now. So <laughs> thank you. Dan. Dan, I appreciate you, Dan. I really do, brother. All of you guys, you have no idea how much I appreciate you. And 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 just for being here. And I, I need to emphasize something. You can say whatever you want, little sister. Little big sister, because she's Aww. bigger than I am. She's taller than me, guys. <laughs> I'm just a little short shit. You can say whatever you want, dear. Oh. I will, Miss Randy. Okay. Thank you, Paris girl. Um, I saw that, Brandy, and you, you didn't have to do that, hon, but thank you. Um, I, and I know why you're doing it. And I understand. I appreciate you very much, as I always have and always will. I will do that, Miss Tammy. I absolutely will. Thank you. Exactly, Eve. Negativity is not good for anyone's mental health. Um, no, not at all. Okay, Molly. Thank you, Molly, for being up here and showing your support, though. We love you. They do, Heather. They they always have, and they will. And thank you. Yep. They absolutely do. I, mo, every most everybody in here does, Heather. They they love me. They love the, the, our family. They all do. And thank you for that, mm, Heather. You know I got his back. I know. I know, Brandy. I absolutely do. Everybody. I know that you do, and I know that that and for somebody to say that to me. That says a lot, hon. And I appreciate you trusting me to say that to me. You know what I mean? You don't have to do that. And that's why mm -hmm. I, I, it means a lot to me, hon. Thank you, Miley. 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 I think it's Miley. I appreciate that so very much. Uh, and I'm glad that you see that because I try every day as hard as I can to be that person. I really do. Uh, because I, like I said, guys, you guys, in my opinion, deserve... Um, nothing but thank you, Heather. I, and they, they do, hon. They will. 
Um, yeah, he's a stinker, but yeah, we respect him. <laughs> um, what was I? What was I going to say? I'm sorry, I don't know. Jackie, Jackie, what? Butchable, thank you for what? being here. Thank you for the super chat. I don't have my noisemaker thing hooked up right now, so I can't do that. Um, me better than me. I go. This is what I. Okay. Well, thank. I'm that. That means a lot to me, brother. I. It, it's just who I am, you know. No, you're right, Tammy. That's his name, Caden. You're doing good, though, bro. I watch your stuff. I support Absolutely. you. You're doing good, bro. I appreciate it. I send people to you all the time. Speaking of which, if we could have somebody drop a link, guys. Uh, Tommy Jude. This man is at 939 subscribers, guys. He only needs so many more to hit 1,000. You guys know that I support other creators best way I can, just as I was supported when I started. Go over there and subscribe to him, guys. Check it out if you can. Get him up to 1,000 if we can. He deserves it. He puts in a lot of work, folks. He really does. Um. He's supposed to be dropping some big video today, he said, for those of you guys that check him out. Go go support him, guys. Let's put a link in the chat. Get him to a what thousand. Is, Get him what is his day. Once Upon a Crime Time? Once Upon a Crime Time, yes. That's him. Uh, thank you, Kimberly, and I, I love you, too, so very much. Old-fashioned cigarettes. Old-fashioned? <laughs> what do you mean? Hmm? They're old-fashioned with the filter? They're not, they're not, oh, no, no, no. Do they look <laughs> like they're filled? Reverend Cynthia, good to see you. He didn't finish it. Oh, he didn't get it finished. Okay, well, either way, guys, if you can, just go show Tommy some love. Get him up to a 1,000. He deserves it. He puts a lot of work in. He really does. I, I don't know. I, I know what he's doing. I know the time he's spending on it, so, you know. Absolutely. Uh, and that's true. Crime solver. Correct. Appreciate your self insight and awareness. Love your channel, but must turn away sometimes with rants. We'll stay engaged though. Good luck. There you go. Good stuff. He's a beautiful boy. Good stuff. Bro, a old this is a drink. Oh, Heather. I don't know what that means. Don't know. I don't know what that meant. I think she's trying to say old fashioned is a drink. You're muted. Okay, him. got you. Okay, got you. <laughs> yeah, that's what Brandy just said. Oh my gosh, Rock Chalk. 101 in Kansas today? Wow. That's crazy. Tommy's hilarious. He cracks me up. He is. He's funny. He's very talented. Um, like his intro and all that stuff. That, you know, he's he's a musician too, by the way. I don't know if you guys know he's a guitar player. Uh, he's very good at what he does. Um, so yeah, please at least for the time that he puts in. I've always told you guys this. I I I may not agree with certain other creators, but I always will respect them, even ones that don't like me, that have said shit about me. Their creator work that they do out here on YouTube, the YouTube work they do, I respect it because it takes time. I respect them because uh -oh. what they're doing. So, you know, I can't even get this hardwired. <laughs> Are we here? Are we still here? Bombshell, what's going yep, on? Still Good here. to see you. So I can't promise you guys it's going to be great tonight because the storms are coming in and I'm on a Wi-Fi signal. As soon as it's hardwired, it will be better. That I will promise. I'm going to try to have. They're supposed to be here today. They never showed up. Oh, Stay away from optimum internet, folks. That's all I can say. There we go. Good. Thank you, Heather, so very much. Tommy's a good guy. He's got a great heart. Seriously. Mm -hmm. Let's get him to a thousand, everybody. Let's do that if we can. Please, please, please. So that's all done. It's out there. It's done. It's over. We're moving forward. Um, as I said, guys, there were some new documents that were dropped around the 23rd. I don't know if you guys saw them. There was quite a few, actually. 
And then I was just gonna, cause I always show you, thank you, Dana. I appreciate, appreciate that so very much. Um, very, very much actually. Again, you guys are what keeps me above water. All of you guys, I told you before, if I don't do this, it's a bad day, folks. It's the highlight of my day. It really is. So thank you. Uh, yes, they did find Suzanne Morpheus. Um, mm -hmm. You know, it's it's sad. And I don't know if you guys, whenever you guys get a chance, you need to go check out Jules' newest video. It's crazy. It's good. It's good, but it's crazy, the scenario that she's talking about. So please don't forget about Jules. Uh, check her out as well. Natural Healing, good to see you. Uh, uh, nothing happened, Bombshell. I just... I just explained something uh, in regards to another scenario. Like I said, I'm not going to slam these people. I will not do that regardless. Um, and I don't want to see anybody doing it in here, please. Whatever you do in your own personal business is up to you. Is Tommy in here? Did he come in? No, it looks like he's live right now. Oh, thank you, Brandy. Yeah, I figured he would be. I figured he would be. Thank you, Brandy, for that. Again, guys. Let me re-explain this one more time. When I do this, and in any super chats or anything that I get, I tell you that this channel is 100% crowdfunded because it is. This goes to my my internet, as much as I don't want to pay them because it's crap, but I have to pay them. My internet, my stream yards, my YouTube premium, and it just keeps the bills paid, okay? Any donations I get goes to that. Nothing else which is where this whole lying thing that I was telling you about came from. It doesn't go to that at all. It goes to this. So that's that. Deborah Polly, good to see you. All right. So let me clear my throat. Ron Potter. Oh, wow. You and Tommy on a live stream. That'd be interesting. Well, I was over there with him. Yeah, but that's at nighttime. I don't ever see that. Uh, v. Oakley. Tommy is Tommy Jude from Once Upon a Crime Time with Tommy Jude. He's usually um, on the panel with Rory from Thou Shalt Not Kill True Crime. Yep, he's frozen again. Uh, you're welcome, hon. I'm not sure where Brian is. Yeah, Brian comes and goes. Sometimes he's here a lot and sometimes he disappears for a little bit and then he comes back. I'm yeah. sure he's okay. I hope he's okay. I haven't seen him in a little while. Yeah. Um, we love Brian. Yeah, Brian's awesome. Um, guys, I'm so, so, so sorry about this internet thing. Um, yeah, I know, Heather. Like I said, guys, I'm running on a Wi-Fi extender right now because I couldn't get the cable company here to hardwire this, to remove the wires around. I may end up doing it myself if they don't hurry up and do something because I can't keep going. <laughs> Caroline, you're funny. What'd she say? Oh, I'm out. <laughs> Oh, you're frozen. Yeah, you guys are <laughs> I haven't seen Brian in a while. I, I am I was actually thinking about him yesterday. I hope he is okay. Um, yeah, Prime Solver, I saw that too. That was not cool. What happened? Another channel was. I know. And I sometimes Brian takes things personal, and I hope he's not. Yeah. I hope, yes, I did, natural. Um, I'm in my den now on my new equipment that mm -hmm. 
some amazingly wonderful people donated to get me going, to keep me going, I should say. Yeah, Wisdom, he does have some medical stuff, too. So. Right. All right, guys, keep your fingers crossed that this stays running while I do this. Please. Where did that go? What's the matter? Oh, I was... Cryptic said... You and Dago could both live stream on the same screen using both your channels. I don't know how to do that. Do you? What? It says you and Dago could both live stream on the same screen using both your channels. Yeah. Uh, if you were to go live... On your channel, it'll give you like me and uh, CJ. We're gonna we talked about doing it one time. Up when you go like right now, if you look, you're on Streamyard, right? Yeah. If you look to the right in the right corner of your screen, it'll say "Stream to your audience" in a little blue box, or it should. Mm, no, I don't see that. I see, I see in stream. <laughs> Okay, maybe it's the way you have it set up. But, like, when I would go live was, like, well, anybody, truthfully, I would pop up on, and then it would say, it's okay, Molly. It would say to the right, stream to your audience. And I, if I were to click on that, it would send out the signal as if I were live, too, and it would bring us together. Hmm. Interesting. And then, like Cryptic is saying, then we both would get the same amount, like however many people are in here. And we got 174 mm -hmm. people, by the way. That's so awesome, and I love you guys for that. Absolutely. That's crazy for 10 o'clock at night. That's okay. <laughs> I'm grateful to you all. Doodlebug, great to see everybody that has jumped in since. I'm so grateful for you to be here. And um, I, I love you guys to death. CSI Obscura. And you both get the numbers. Hmm. Since I have been harassed, since I kicked Diego off my live show by Jay What? Huh? What are you reading? Since I have been harassed, since I kicked Diego off my live show by Jay What are we talking about now? Okay, I don't know what that is, but... Anyway, I don't need any more drama in here that we already have. Right. So, let's keep it down to a minimum, folks. Yeah, that was weird. <laughs> yeah. Double live stream is more, more reach, more fun for the... Yeah. yeah, we'll have to try that out one time. Maybe yeah. we can do it one time too, J-Rod. We'll see what happens. Yeah, I wondered if that's who that was, J Rod. I just I just kinda caught on to myself. Mm. All right. It is what it is. So be it. Yeah. I don't understand, but whatever. Hey, Carrie. I don't do the drama. I don't like the drama. I like yeah. calm, cool, collective. So I'm trying to get these calming uh docs up for you guys to see real quick. And let's see, we got, wait, where'd they go? Uh-oh. <laughs> what the hell? How did okay. you lose? Them? There was like six documents that dropped on the 23rd and they're gone. No way. I Where's swear to God they're gone. Did anybody else check those? I'm going to look right now. Uh, no, natural healing. No, no, no. But why can't they put these in like month files or something? Oh, yep, it stops at the twenty first. What happened? There was like six <laughs> documents that they were there this morning. Wow. Nothing half asked. Good to see you. That's interesting. Uh, I agree on uh, half asked. There should not be any feuds. There should be no nothing like that. I I don't I don't have feud with people. I, I try not to. Uh, Layla, thank you for being here. I wanted to tell you I lost my backpack with all my stuff. I should be getting my new card soon, so I'm showing 
oh, honey, don't worry about that. You're fine. Don't worry about it. Anybody that isn't a member, don't worry about that either. Oh, I got you, J-Rod. I got you. I, they must have. That's a good point, Sherry. They must have sealed them overnight. I'll be damned. Wow. Gina says they finally arrested her boyfriend. Who are we talking about, Gina? Well, I guess I'm not showing you guys documents then. Well, that's a good point, Wanda. Thank you. Unfortunately, bombshell, yes. A court date with no subpoena. Right, Daisy. Do you know the section where you would join as a member? You can click. Oh, yeah. In fact... All right, make sure that you're opened up to accept gifts, uh, guys. For those of you, just make sure that you can receive uh, memberships um, in that section, okay? Well, Jesse Lynn, there was new documents, and apparently there they were, disappeared. There were, there were six of them, but Sherry just said maybe they were sealed overnight. But I swear I saw them this morning, because that's what I was going to talk to you guys about. You know, I always show you guys the new documents when they come out. I wow. Wow. What's the matter, J Rod? Did I miss something? They did that in Delphi too? Are you serious? You what? That they sealed everything from Delphi too, Sherry said. Hmm. Huh. Oh, wow. They're getting dark. Welcome back, Coco. Yeah, there was like six documents dropped on the 23rd. A couple of them seemed like they were kind of actually really interesting. I'm like, cool. I'll, I'll bring up all the docs tonight. We'll talk about it. I assure you that Dago and I are two separate entities. <laughs> what, somebody think me and you are the same person, Heather? <laughs> they go sit there first. Welcome back, go. Coco. Docs, what's next now? I know, 12. What's going on? One of the docs was no was cams allowed for October twenty sixth. Really, Joanne? Damn it. Yeah, but if there's cams allowed, aren't they trying to close that hearing? Hmm. They're gone. Gone, gone, gone. Wow. Katie Perrin and Lisa Castillo. Welcome, welcome. I don't know if she did or she didn't, Carolyn. It, here's the thing, guys. Even if you did get them, I did that one time. When they disappeared, mine disappeared too. Don't ask me how that happens unless I didn't do something right, but they did. Oh, there was, LR. There was like five or six documents that dropped on the 23rd. I saw them last night, and they're gone. Evie Marie, welcome, dear. Good to see you. Jesse Lynn, cameras are not allowed in the morning session. The hearing at 1 is open to the public and will be cameras. Thank you, Jesse. That's okay, Valerie. No worries, dear. Phantasmic ether. Oh, no, I can't. It's not hooked up. Oh, damn it. I'm sorry. I'll make it work soon. Thank you for joining us, Fantasmic. Um, what are we talking about here? 
You have a screenshot of one, Joanne? Okay, cool. Uh, yes, yeah, Suzanne Moore found, finally. Very sad. Delphi wants no cameras in the courtroom, of course. I'll tell you what, though, folks. Um, oh. Okay, maybe good to see you. Let me get with the church there. David is, oh my God. Okay. Well, that's that's his business. Uh, but it. I don't. We don't need to know that in here. CSI. It doesn't matter. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now I have to do this. Jesus. <clears throat> what happened? Nothing. Another comment about J Rod. Mm. There, it's banned now. It's taken care of. Hello, Phantasmic Ether. You know, you're not the only person to say that, Rod. There's quite a few people that have been saying that recently. Um, so I can see why you're saying mm -hmm. it. That's... <laughs> so be it. So be it. Yes, I know, Joanne. Unfortunately. I don't understand it. Nobody talks about this person. Nobody says anything about this person. Nobody harasses nothing. Uh, thank you, Lisa. It's good to see you. And this person still continuously goes on and on about things. It's I don't get it. It is what it is. Yes, Carolyn. Yes, yes, yes. So, like I said, I'll be honest with you guys. I did... I mean, I followed... Um, Delphi, but I didn't follow it like, like crazy, like, okay. So somebody pointed something out to me guys the other day and I could not believe it. Oh, you're, you're good. You're good. J-Rod. Don't worry about it, bro. I'm just trying to keep everybody else from, from harassing you or that person from harassing you in here. Um, Sandy toes and Brandy. What's up guys. Sandy toes, Miss Brandy. Thank you for joining us. Um, do I need to go back and say this again since other people jumped in or? What, from the beginning? Yeah. No. Okay. They can rewatch it. Okay. It's a good idea. Um, yeah, the Delphi stuff. So, like I said, I didn't follow it like crazy like you know I, I followed it but what's up uh virgo mystic virgo good to see ya and absolutely bombshell absolutely what are you saying no for mikey do you need to say it again no oh yeah okay i'm just saying <laughs> no it wasn't really a bombshell pumpkin dawn it was just something i was stating to try to stop some drama um so I don't know. Um the um Delphi thing, you know, it's probably gonna end up just being a hanging out thing since we don't have the documents, but we can talk a little bit about Delphi, of course. Um the video, the railroad track thing, the video of him supposedly Richard Allen walking up the the tracks, do you know what I mean? Um, I never paid attention to it as close until the other day, guys. It something's not right with that video. Does anybody else agree with me? It's way I off. I haven't really paid attention, so. Well, I I'm going to show you what I'm talking about here. It's way off as far as I'm concerned. I never looked at it like that. I mean, I watched it because it was on the news. You know how that goes. Right. I was watching it, but I wasn't analyzing it. Like I well, like we do with some other things. Thank you so very much, Miss Brandy. Thank you, Sha. That's right. Uh, thank you, Kendra, for sending that stuff. Uh, Kendra has some interesting stuff about the. Uh... So I want you guys to see something. Thank you, Daisy. I think my wife noticed it first, and then. 
Okay, here we go. I did not pay attention to it like this. Absolutely, Miss Kendra. I want you guys to check this out, and I want your opinion. Also, share audio. Yes. Okay. Here we go. Now, everybody has seen this video. We've all seen this video. Thank you, Daisy, so much for that, hun. Appreciate you, darling. So this is the video I'm talking about, guys. We've all seen it. We all know what it's about, right? I watched it. That's it. I watched it. Thank you, by the way. 226 awesome people in here. Pearl Outhouse, welcome. Good to see you. Terry T. You guys are awesome, guys. I love you guys to death. So, watch this real quick here. I've heard something about that gate. Yes. Yes. That's what I'm talking about, Mike. The gate. The walk. His gate. When he walks, watch this, folks. And tell me what you think. Never noticed this before. And you know when I start looking at something, guys, I get neurotic about it. I, I analyze it. Right? right here we okay. go. Yeah. So <laughs> anyway, now imagine this guy walking down this trestle. He's just walking, hands in pockets, whatever. So be it. That's what I saw. That's all I saw until I looked at it again, and then I stared at it. Miss your girl, good to see you, dear. M cause, welcome all of you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Did you see that? Tell me that that does not look like a video that's being looped. Uh, yeah, or there's been a chunk cut out and pieced, Something. poorly pieced together. Yes, Rolo. <laughs> gotta, gotta love Rolo, okay? He's a little crazy here and there, but he's Rolo. <laughs> he's he, he does his thing. He's very, very observational, folks. Yes, good, man, good, good so, eye. Yes. Very good eye. He was like, Dago, the video, watch this. And I'm like, and and my wife had said something about it. And I didn't really look. She was like, something don't look right about that. You know, then he pointed it out. And I'm like, I'll be damned. Yeah, I'm going to play it a couple times. Watch this. Right there. Tell me that's not looped. Or something yeah. was hacked or cut or whatever. Ashley Nicolette, thank you for joining us. We got another Aussie in the house. Good to see you. But yes. That is a loop video that's been cut, clipped. Yep. Look at it. It's the same step over and over again. Yeah, it's like as soon as he raises that right leg. Yep. A little bit. And then and it watch, you'll see it come up. The right leg comes up way higher than it's supposed to right there. See it? Right there, and then it flips back to the back yep. behind him again. That is a looped, cut, clipped, edited, whatever you want to call video. I never noticed it before. I believe that guy could be the father of the guy dating one of the victims. Also seems that he has a stomach. Yes, yes, I know. That was something else that Rolo noticed. He may mention is right here. There's something in that pocket. Rolo said he saw a firearm. I don't know if I, I don't see that. There's definitely a bulge right here. Okay. Uh, Salty says the actual video is 43 seconds long. Ellie only released a clip recorded on Libby's phone. They have admitted they cut it. The word guys doesn't come. Wait, the word guys doesn't come before down the hill. Ah, thank mm. you, Salty. They say he's walking funny because the railroad tracks are on it. You can tell it's the same step over and over again. Mm -hmm. You can you can see it. Right there. It's just like it's an over it's a it's a loop. I swear it's a loop. Yeah. Brings that right leg up and then it flips right. Behind you. And, and the audio is is over is overlaid too. Okay, it, it's cut, clipped, whatever they did to it. It's definitely not. It's looped. Period. Yeah, crime solver. When we say clipped, they like cut out a they cut off a portion of the video and either just left part of it out, 
or they added other pieces to it. Yeah, so and uh, there we go. That's the word I was looking for. Ag said, "I think they did it to show his gate." Well, either way, it just makes me go, "Hmm, something's wrong." And when you hear guys down the hill, thank you, Joanne. It sounds like two different conversations that they put together. I'm sorry, but that's how I feel about it. I'm not saying that it's fact because I can't prove it. It sure as hell sounds like two different conversations that were put together. The pause, okay, you know, under review, good to see you. Oh, thank you, under review. I appreciate you. Um, look at the hip to knee. Each leg, his left leg is shorter. Yeah, right, Carolyn. And you can just see that it's the same step every time. It's definitely looped. Like I said, Delphi needs to be looked at from the beginning again, in my opinion. It does. Um, and I never really got to cover it. So here we are. Um. I don't know. Um, Kimberly KV. Where are we at here? I'm going to bring up some stuff that Miss Kendra sent me here in a second. They said they cut stuff because of what was said and what happened is too private and it protects the girls. Okay. Well, I get it. Well, Salty, I didn't necessarily mean photoshopped. I was just using that term for some people that don't understand. The other terminology they know that the photo video had been edited yeah to an extent someone on the news did interview and said there's two voices in the see and that sounded like two different voices to me in that clip part two i might be wrong but they should have released this clip from there yeah i agree i agree salty i do they yeah. they, they do these things all the time <laughs> but anyway um let me pull up this stuff that, that Miss Kendra sent me. Thank you, by the way, again, Kendra. And understand, guys, I always appreciate anybody, anything your guys, you guys send this way, any participation whatsoever. Uh, because I like I said, we're not we're not the only hard workers out here that do what we do. You guys do as much hard work as we do. That's why I try to give everybody the chance to speak their mind on different things and show their stuff. Uh, you guys deserve that right too. Just because you don't have a channel don't mean you don't need to be heard. Uh, what are you saying there? Is that what he says? Call me ignorant. I just can't wrap up my mind in this day and age, how these cases go years on. So I agree with you. I do agree with you, especially with the DNA technology we have, we've seen, you know, it, it should have been a smack bang boom, but unfortunately we all know that that didn't happen. Uh, okay. Let's see here. Ooh. Thank you, Joanne. I got the court doc. Thank you there. Order defendants when it's 10 30 a.m. Can't really see it very well. Miss Joanne just sent me this. This is one of the court docs that we're not able to see that are gone now. Um, let me see if I can blow it up. Oh, a little too big there. That way you guys can see that real quick for what you can. It's It's just a clip of it, but... And Mama Bear, can you give me one second? I got to go grab my coffee yeah. real quick. I'll be right back. Thank okay. you. Was 100%
Yeah, I don't see a resemblance to Alan and this guy on the bridge at all. The key to so many issues, look at yeah. She say, I believe this sister that dropped them off at the location knows more than was Yeah, I bet you're right. Whew, boy, did his jail diet kick in. My goodness. Yikes. Are you talking about Alan? <laughs> yes. Yeah, he looks horrible. He really he does. does. Like, wow. It's very sad. Okay, so Miss uh, Miss Kendra here, um, she sent some documents over. Uh, some well, some stuff over here via email that uh, said that we should take a look at in regards to Delphi. So we're going to take a look at um, what she sent over. It's kind of interesting, guys. One second here. Hey, North Carolina Mountain Man, how are you? What's up, Mountain Man? Good to see you, brother. Um, that's what I've heard. Conversions. Uh, cryptic conversions is that they there's a good resemblance there. Again, Kendra, thank you for this. Inana Shu, thank you so much for joining us tonight. Have a wonderful night. Good night, uh, thank you so very much. Anybody that is leaving or had to leave, I appreciate your support, your understanding, and just for being who you are, you being you, folks. I appreciate and love you guys just for that. Got to go. So, TC guys, take care, AG. Thank you again, all of you, for being here. Yeah, I. That's that's what I heard as well, Zoe. Christy, good to see you. Thanks for joining us. Okay. Mm. All right. Now, again, guys, let me know if the audio is okay on this. This is definitely um, Kendra saying, "Watch out for music." Don't want. Oh, it's okay, hon. I'll I'll clip it if I get it. Don't worry about that. I can trim it. I appreciate it though. He's only in his in this to catch the perps. <laughs> right. I gotcha. No worries. No worries at all. But thank you for the warning. I appreciate that. All right, here we go. Make sure this is big enough. <laughs> Something came before the words down the hill, but the down the hill parts are the same as what they released. Mm -hmm. They, were, they didn't describe the car. What do you mean the white truck? Just now they never described the car. He said he had no description of the car. I'm assuming it's the white truck that was there. Wow. Yeah, he, he just asked him specifically like two minutes ago oh. he described the vehicle. He said he had no description. Oh, he, they yeah, the audio is a little rough. Let me see if I can. Yeah. Okay. It says they're on. <laughs> <That's> her... <laughs> Sorry, Heather. Yeah. It, <laughs> it, it, the audio is a little bit bad, but hold on. I think we're good on that. I'm trying to use subtitles. This sounds like poop. <laughs> she said poop. <laughs> 
All right, I'm mute. Wow, that's one of my favorite songs on the whole planet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna get black for that one. I'll be clipping that later. Mm -hmm. not old that's fresh yeah if it was old it would be brown that's red still mm -hmm. that's a little more faded but that's zoink scoob what's over there on the left side of the picture is that yeah a stick somebody's holding a, like a walk it looks like a walking stick type thing like a walking stick okay maybe hmm. Damn, Kendra, that's a good, good eye. Very good eye. Wow. I'm whose not leg? Sure, Jesse. Yeah, whose leg is this, Kendra? Do we know? Look at the boots too. Okay, but now the shoe over here. This shoe looks to be. I may be wrong, but it looks to be a child's. <clears throat> Branch, maybe okay, yeah, but it looks like it's been shaved. 
Okay, like the, the tree bark shaved off of it. Uh, do we have a link for this, where this video came from, Kendra? Look at the name on the post. Uh, okay, hold on. Only some actors were aware of their pant parts. <laughs> Eye of Apophis is the name of the channel. Walking stick, not a branch. Salty says two different, two different boots. Now these two are the same, but these are. I don't know if those are children's tennis shoes or if that's an adult size foot. That's hard to tell. February 19th, 2017. The date's right here, folks. See it? It, it doesn't it does look smaller, doesn't it, Salty? That's why I said immediately it looks like it could be a child's foot. Huh. Laughing stock says three feet, not right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Diane Granny Squirrel. Welcome, Miss Diane. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, Evie, it appears there's two guys standing there. Yeah. Anyway, that's a great eye, Miss Kendra. Let me go forward with it. Yeah, these two are boots for sure. Okay. That... Is a tennis shoe like a van or something type shoe? It, it see, it did look kind of teenager like to me, Daisy. That's why I was saying I don't. Maybe it isn't smaller. I don't know. It looked a little smaller to me. I don't know. Let's keep going. <laughs> Hey, Leslie, we're talking about Delphi. 
I would like to thank the media for their patience. I understand there's information that you would like to get to your uh, subscribers, to get out into the media. But as you know, we have information that's germane to our investigation uh, that we have to keep close to the vest because it's an investigation uh, that we have to keep close to the vest because this is your uh, subscribers to get out into the media. But as you know, we have information that's germane to our investigation uh, that we have to keep to the media. But as you know, we have information that's germane to our investigation uh, that we have to keep close to the to do so until this case is solved. To the members of the community, um, when I met with our behavioral analysis unit uh, and, and their expertise and their experience, it is oftentimes even unwitting uh, that, that a member of the community may have information that is germane to this investigation. And I'd like, I'd like the community to, uh, to, to, to go back nine days and go back to the afternoon of February 13th. And you may have information that is germane to this investigation. And you may have information that is germane to this investigation. And I'd like, I'd like the community to. Uh, I'm sorry, folks. I got to interrupt. I guess I can't just. Jesus Christ. Thank you, J Rod. So. Uh -oh. Yeah, somebody sent him an email saying that I lied, which I didn't. <sighs> Sorry, guys, I got to continue with this more. Dago just lied to you and to everyone. He's out there acting like a victim advocate, which I, I am. And I do support. I absolutely do support people that need help, okay? And I definitely do not condone things like this. As I told you, it's disgusting, it makes me sick. Exactly. Whether this is my blood or not, it's wrong, it makes me sick and I don't support it, okay? We were told, okay? I'm not lying about anything. We were told what I told you. What I'm getting ready to read you, I had no idea of, and that's God's honest truth on my grandchildren's life. No idea if this is, I don't even know if this is true or not, but anyway, um, I was never told this. So that's why I can tell you I don't know this. Um, I've never said, this is Joseph, the one he calls Joe and amazing. I've never called him amazing. Have you ever heard me say that, Bear? No. Never. No. Never. I've told you guys, a lot of you guys from the beginning that this kid has a drug had a drug problem which is why i was estranged from him and hadn't spoken to him in three years before this happened um and yes february of 23 i just i told you when did i when did i say this just happened he was arrested two years ago right yeah and he just went in this past year or year and a half or whatever however long it's, it's yeah, going on like a year that. now sorry it's going on a year my apologies i was wrong about that anyway let me read it real quick. He's out there acting like a piece of shit just lied about a real victim of his own son. Okay. Yes, he's me and my ex-wife's biological child. Again, I don't condone anything. He's, he's 30 years old. I can't control him. Well, he's almost 30. I'm sorry. Never said he was amazing. Um, all I was ever told was that he had four charges put against him and it was dropped down to two. Okay, that's what I was told. Um, and he pled guilty February of 23. That's true. And went in this past February. Uh, I was told there was no physical proof. Okay. Mm -hmm. We were told that there was a kit done and that there was nothing in that kit. That's what we were told. I had no way to get any other information about it because, again, we didn't know. Um, and it says that he found out about the forensic examination of the, the victim showing her, I'm not going to say was destroyed and changed his plea to guilty. That's not what we were told. Again, my right hand to God. That's not what we were told. We were told that he was told that if he did not plead take a plea deal or plead out, whatever it's called, that he would spend the rest of his life in, in, in prison. This way, if he took the plea deal, that he would get 
whatever, a, a, min a minimal, a, a lesser of sentence, okay? That's what we were told. So that's true. And I would never condone anything like this, nor lie about it. So did I lie about anything, Mama Bear? No, not a thing. Know. That is exactly what I knew of this. Again, I told you, I had spoken to this person, in, to my, my son. He's my son, biologically. He is my son for three years before this, okay? I do not condone this. I'm not. And if I find out that it's fact, any of this stuff like this, if I ever find out things like this are fact, of course I'm going to um, advocate for the victim. My blood or not, it's disgusting, folks. So that doesn't make me a bad person because he did this. I can't control this. I didn't tell him to do this. I didn't teach him to do this. That has nothing to do with me. So once again, I'm sorry that you had to receive this, um, J-Rod, but that, that's the truth. Are there any other questions before I, I let it go? It's a very disgusting thing. I told you I'm very disappointed about this, okay? There's nothing that I can do about it. So, I'm sorry that it happened. I, I'm very sorry that it happened. If it happened, again, we were told. We were told by, because I called personally when I found out about this to talk to, actually, we were called, I'm sorry. We were called by an investigator that worked for the um, the uh, public defender, and we were asked a certain set of questions about his character. Mm -hmm. And then I asked other questions about this. They said, of course, they couldn't tell me certain things. Uh, and I asked him, I said, you're you're the, the attorney. You work for the attorney. Can you tell me? Like, did this happen? He goes, I haven't seen anything, sir. Other than hearsay. Those were the words we were told. That's why I told you guys that. That's all I know. If that's not true, and again, I don't condone this type of thing. It's absolutely disgusting. Whether it's my some my relation or not, that's all. Okay? Right. It's okay, guys. It's okay. Nobody in here needs to apologize. It's nobody's fault. Okay? But I don't condone no, it. but it's ridiculous that these people keep doing this we were told that there was nothing founded evidence wise that there if that's true i never knew that never heard that i was oh, told yeah j-rod no you're good hon yeah i, I know i want to know these things bro yeah i want to know this okay um yeah i never knew that it's disgusting to know that if that's true i'm i'm more disgusted than i was that's a fact folks okay I was told there was a kit done and nothing was found. Those were the words that I was told. Period. And honestly, he's a grown, his son is a grown adult. They don't have to tell Dago anything. Okay. Well, again, I didn't find I mean, out about it till way, way late. You know what I mean? Yeah. But I mean, your son's a grown adult. Legally, they don't have to tell you anything. Mm-hmm. Like so I you're said, lucky I, that you got the info that you got. I hadn't mentioned, or I hadn't spoken to him in three years because, um, again, I'm going to explain this, and people can look down on me or not. I had a young child here. My son had a very bad problem with, uh, it started with, I think it's called Adderall, and then it went to meth, okay? Very bad. <clears throat> and Mama Bear knows, that, knows this story. I told her this a long time ago. But anyway... Um, and I said, I can't have him around Caden, the youngest one, most of you guys know, because of this. Okay. Uh, it's a bad influence and sadly Caden looked up to him. So it is what it is. But anyway, all of that, that, that doesn't mean that because he did this whenever he did it, cause I don't even know when it actually took place. I think I was told July of the year before last is when it supposedly took place. Okay. Now I know I know that his mother knows all the details, but of course, I was not given anything to look at. I was not told anything more than that. That's what I know. That's fact. My right hand to God. Um, how this person knows more than I do, I would really like to know that, honestly. Because I didn't even know that. 
again, like I said, I was told a specific type of kit was done and there was nothing founded, that it was all based on hearsay. Unless those are people, you know, with the rumor mill, maybe, I don't know. But uh, it's facts, folks, you know. Was there anything else that I needed to explain before I went forward with anything else? I mean, it's it's bad enough that I have to talk about this as it is. It's it's embarrassing. It's humiliating. It's disgusting. I'm disgusted over it. But again, I'll explain what I got to explain because I have nothing to hide from it, and I don't support it at all. Whether he's biologically my 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 blood or not, I don't support that. And I've even said to you guys, a lot of you guys in here, and Mama Bear knows this too, that if if um was I going to say if one of my children were to commit a crime and I knew about it that I would turn them in myself because I don't condone Correct. they know better they know better okay I don't know crime solver I don't know what this person this person stated that I was out here doing, I guess you call it grifting, making money to send to my son in prison, which I don't. Everything that I've ever gotten donation-wise pays my bills to do this and has helped to buy my, my, you know, my equipment and stuff like that. That's all. That's it. So somebody, for whatever reason, is upset with me for something and decided to go look this up and find it and throw it at out here to try to hurt me. I didn't do anything to this person. I never had. I supported this person. I was very, very supportive of this person. So I don't understand what the, you know, why, but whatever. I am definitely a victim advocate though. I would never allow for anything like this to go through my fingers without turning it on, whether it's my child or not. I told you guys that. It's disgusting to me. Oh, well, I guess that could be what it is, Salty, I guess. I'm not sure, but that's a good point. I never thought of it like that. Anyway, if anybody is, is upset with me over this, okay. Um, you know, I'm not saying that you guys have to be here. I'm not trying to be rude either. I don't want to say that, sound that way, but... If anybody's right, upset Ellie. with me. It, I, I agree, Valerie. I know. If anybody's upset with me, I understand. I, I had nothing to do with this. You know what I mean? I really, I, I really didn't. And, and again, somebody obviously just doesn't like me. So, so be it. So be it. I'm, I'm so exactly, sorry. Exactly, Stevie. And I'm so sorry that this has to interrupt what I'm trying to do, folks. But some people, you know, I don't know. Like I said, I'm not going to talk bad about who it is. I would be sinking to their level by doing that. And that's just not who I am. I won't do it. And I don't, you guys don't need to do it. You can do, oops, sorry. What you guys got to do on your own time. What did Mike just say? Oh, thank you, TV. Mike said something I just saw. Oh, that was on the other side. Okay. I know. I know, Leslie. Uh, like I said, yeah, I was told that, and my wife already contacted the attorney, Paris, about defamation of character thing. So uh, the attorney's supposed to call back tomorrow. You know, I don't like to do things like that, but people, and I wasn't going to talk about that, but, you know, yeah. The scenario is an awful scenario. It's a horrible scenario. If what happened happened, it's it's horrific, folks. It makes me absolutely disgusted, nauseous. It, it when I heard about it, I I was on a live stream and I had to get off the live stream. Thank you, Miley. Miley, sorry. Here we go. I'm shaking again now. Um. Anyway. That is what I know, folks. So, so I didn't lie about anything. I won't lie about anything. I know exactly what I know. I did not know 
I understand that, Cryptic, but he is in prison. So if it's if it's true, that's where he deserves to be. And that's a fact, you guys. If this, and I'm saying this blatantly, live as it is, I don't care. If it's true, he deserves to be there. And I did speak with him. I have spoken with him. And I asked him, did you do this? After Ashley, it it's not a channel. It's just a person. They don't have their own channel. Um, I spoke with him after all of this went down. And I said to him, did you do this? No, Dad, I didn't. And I said, are you lying to me because you're ashamed or whatever? And he said, no, I really didn't do it, Dad. I'm not saying he's not lying, folks, but that's what he told me when I spoke to him. And I told him, these are the words that came out of my mouth, my right hand to God on my grandchildren's lives. If you did this, son, I love you, but I can't accept it. And I won't accept it. And that's that. It's wrong. It's sickening. It doesn't make sense to me. It never has. But that's all there is to it, period. That's what I said to him. And he knows that. So that's all I can say, folks. Is there anything else that I need to talk about? Uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a sad thing. We can't control what our, our siblings do, what our families do, our children sometimes. He's almost 30 years old, folks. Almost 30 years old. I never claimed him to be amazing. I said I have amazing children. Yeah, I was going to say, I've never heard you say that. Never specified him, okay? I do love him with all my heart because i he's my child. I'm very disappointed and disgusted with the situation, but I do love him. I can't stop that. And if that's what, if that, if that's what this person wants me to do is not love my child because he made a horrible, horrible, disgusting mistake if he did it, Sorry, that can't happen. I can't change that inside myself, okay? I, I just don't understand why. Why, how this affects me. Because I had nothing to do with it, never would. You know what I mean? But anyway, it, well, it is your business, Josie. It is your business. Because, you know, other people believe that it needs to be your business. That's fine. Thank you, Kim. Thank, you know, you guys are amazing. Every one of you guys. There's not one person in here that's made a negative comment that I've seen yet. This is why I absolutely love and adore this community. You guys are beautiful people. That's not a lie. And I just, I'm sad for the person that is doing this because obviously there's something wrong with that person that they like to try to hurt people. Exactly. I just don't get it. And the person that I was told is doing this, I felt horrible for the things that that person went through in her, in her life. Yeah. And advocated and what for her. had supposedly happened to her from other creators. That and too. That too. That's why I opened my door. She turns around and does this. It's the mind There's blowing. a couple of them from what I understand, but. Mm-hmm. I have no way to prove anything else, folks, other than what I knew from word of mouth. Nobody's going to, he's an adult. Nobody's going to give me any documentation. I could not get any kind of discovery packets on that situation because he's a grown man. He's not my child any, you know, I mean, he is, but you know what I mean? He's not a child, child. So whatever. Um, yep. Anybody that is, is, is upset with me, you know. Again, thank you for, to the person that, that for throwing this back in my face again for making me um, to have to think about it again. Because I've tried to push it out of my head, tried not to think about it, tried to ignore the fact that oh, well, I would I don't want to say ignore the fact because it what happened is horrific. It's disgusting. It's horrific. Mm -hmm. Thank thank you, Mikey. You know, and I wholeheartedly feel for this child. And would do anything to take away what happened. But again, I didn't lie to you. I to I was told what I was told. I was told what I was told. Okay? My son's mother told me what I told you. That's what I knew. So, unless she had it wrong, 
or she lied to me, which I don't think she lied. She must have had it wrong. Could be. Maybe you she know, was misunderstood he, or something. He was probably upset and, and misheard or miss whatever. I don't know. But that's what I was told, that there was a kit done, that there was no evidence of anything. That's what I heard. And I'm sorry if I spoke out of turn, but that's what I was told, folks. Nobody's given me any documentation to read from to prove, okay? I'm not allowed to have that because he's not a child anymore. Mm -hmm. So again, my apologies to anybody that is upset with me because of it. There's nothing I can do to control these things. Um, I can tell you that the child was raised mm -hmm. the right way, as were all six of the other kids. Yep. Who all turned out amazing. Well, one of them is a little off. <laughs> the other one's a little off too, but it's not like that. You know, he just has another the other a drug problem, I guess you could say. But anyway, I've done You're nothing. Good. I've done nothing to hurt anybody, and I don't understand why people nope. want to hurt me. All I've done is try to help people, and that's all I want to do. I don't know why I have to be blamed for something that a child that, that's almost 20 years, just barely 20 years younger than me did, okay? And you've done nothing wrong. All we did was try and help them. I just, I don't. The last time we spoke with them, we were trying to help them. And all they did was scream and yell at us and accuse us of doing wrong. And then they disappeared. Well, I was also told now that that was a, I've been being told that that was a show. Mm, that was being I'm not put surprised. On, that was being put on to go along with this whole thing. So whatever. I It doesn't yeah. matter. Yeah. I opened my doors to people. I would give everybody the shirt off my back. The last, if I had five cents, you'd get four of it. That's just who I am. I'm not any different than that. Okay. I want to help people. I've always wanted to help people. I will continue to want to help people, regardless of the people that don't want me to do that. It's whatever you want to think. So, and I'm Crime sorry. That, that I'm aware of dolphin isn't involved. Oh, no, I don't believe that dolphin has anything to do with it by any means whatsoever by any means whatsoever i was given names of two people possibly a third um i i know rock chalk i've explained mm -hmm. it but i i got another email from thank you j rod i appreciate that brother i really do let me make sure that I got everything, read everything from there so that I can clarify it all. Because, yes, it's a fact. If this was one of my daughters or granddaughters, no, no, no. I would be highly, highly disgusted. And I, I even stated that to him. Okay. He knows. So that, that part there about the, that he found out about the forensic examination of the victim and changed his plea to guilty. That's not how I was told that went. He was given the option to either uh, take it to trial or to plead out. And I was told that he took the plea because he was threatened by the judge that if he pled guilty, that he could possibly spend the rest of his life, uh, or he, if he took it to court, I'm sorry, took it all the way to court, that if he lost, that he could spend the rest of his life in prison. Wow. Or if he took the plea deal, that he would get some such, you know, so much time, which equals out to be, I think it was nine to 15 years in that realm somewhere. Uh, with no no early release or anything from what I understand, that's what he took because he was scared into it that he was going to spend the rest of his life there and still in turn claims that he did not do it. That's what I was told. I knew nothing about what I just read to you. So my apologies. I didn't lie to you. I never heard that before in my life. Again, my right hand to God. So once again, my apologies. Is there anything else I need to explain? No.
Does anybody have any questions or comments for me? Um, you know, I, hi vibes. I have to state this. I am too, but I was also warned. I will say that much. I had multiple people warn me earlier on about these people. I don't know why. And I ignored it and said, no, I give everybody a chance to be who they are to help you know, to try to help people, so on and so forth. That's, I do that. I give, and everybody in here knows that I give people multiple chances, uh, this and that. So I will, I'll learn for myself is what I stated. And I did, you know, so again, I'm not going to sit here and slam these people. I just hope that whatever the reasoning is that they want to try to hurt other people is that they get whatever they need from that, or they get the help they need to help in that sense. So that's all I can say. And, and I, it's sad, you know, and it, it's, it's, it's very hard to, it's hard to think about for me to think about. I, like I said, I pushed it out of my mind and not thought about it. I, it, you know, I know that it happened. I'm very saddened and disgusted by it, but I don't want to think about it every day because it, it's embarrassing for one. It's disgusting and hurtful for two. It's just sad. And I feel so horrible for the for the victim. More than you'll ever understand. Mm -hmm. So that is what it is. Guys, I will always be forthcoming with anything you want to ask me. I have no qualms with telling you anything that you need to ask. Okay? I, I never have not told things about me. There's that too. I just never brought it up. I never hit it. I never didn't talk about it because I was hiding it or lying about it. I didn't talk about it because of it being such a nasty thing uh, and a embarrassing thing. It, it's not something I'm proud of, you know? So, just so once again, people putting words in my mouth stating that I said that he was amazing. I never said that. Never. I haven't never said that since I've live streamed. I may yeah. have said it about Caden because he is. I may have said it about my other chain and my, my twins and my daughters because they are, but I've never mm -hmm. stated it about him or that other child. I've never said that they're amazing no. because they're not, they're not amazing. Okay. Um, I love every one of them with every bit of my heart. I'm, you know, a little darker towards him and the other one actually, but I still love them period. And I can't, again, I can't just shut that off guys. And anybody that has a child knows what I mean when I say that. You can't just turn it off. It hurts. It hurts very bad. Okay. So, again, thank you. You've accomplished what you wanted to do by hurting me. For whatever reason, why you wanted to hurt me, I don't know. But, okay. You accomplished it. So, you, you got what you wanted. And I hope that helped you get what you needed. Thank you, Liz. and disappointing. I'm gonna I'm gonna finish playing this for you guys. To, to to go back nine days and go back to the afternoon of February thirteenth, Monday, February thirteenth, and, and just think if you had an interaction with an individual who uh, inexplicably canceled an appointment that you had had together, or uh, an individual called into work sick um, and um, canceled a, 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 an important appointment or a social engagement. And at the time gave what would have been a plausible explanation. The image that you see there of the suspect that came from Liberty's phone. I think many of you had speculated that before we weren't prepared to discuss that at the time. We have more video. We're not releasing it. It's germane to our investigation. Not releasing it. It's germane to our investigation. And it's important that we spread that person's voice far and wide into our investigation. And it's in, you know, we're not releasing it. It's germane to our investigation. 
and it's important that we spread that person's voice far and wide for somebody that will recognize who that is and will call us and tell us. Again, this is this, this is is very strategic, and I really believe, Marnie, that eventually we're going to take both of those sketches. Remember, a sketch is not a photograph, but we'll take both of those sketches and we'll put them together, and then remove them, and the killer will be behind them. So, so is the there's sketch pieces. A of, uh, uh, Sorry, go ahead. No, no, no. Go ahead, please. I was just going to ask: Is the sketch? How does the public receive this information? Is the sketch? the ultimate suspect, a combination of these two images put on this body that we're seeing on screen right now? Yes, I believe, I, I believe that we'll, 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 we'll be able to put the two of them together and drop the, drop the sketch. And, and that will be, the, that will be the person responsible for the death of Abby and Libby. Yes, we have to talk about what we know now, what we think, right? Yeah. And, and when people, I've heard some criticism about that and I understand it. Mm -hmm. Well, I've given this all this information, I never hear anything bad. I get it, Mandy. Well, believe me, we're keeping all that information. And remember, the sketch is not a photograph. Yeah. I believe the murderer is going to have, have similar characteristics of both sketches. Great point. Well. Great point. Yeah. It's only a sketch. It's not a photograph. Mm -hmm. So stay away from a narrow focus of what you see in the face. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Abra. Say what you need to say. Say what you need to say. Say what you need to say. Hey, Gypsy Rose. You're muted, hon. Uh, thank you so much for that, Kendra. Um, uh, the channel name, I, it, it's, uh, where did it go? I can't remember. Um, Kendra, are you able to put the name of the channel in there, hon? It was an interesting video. Very interesting video. Mm -hmm. Yes, and I know that's my little fireplace going back there. Your hair is on fire what it looks like uh that's it uh eye of the apophis 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 i think it's apophis yes did i get my butter whipped what mandy no idea mandy, what you mean hon thank you kim Thank you all. Hippopotamus. Very much. <clears throat> oh no, I didn't get my ear, dude. This it's just there. Thank you, Rock Jock. Um, all right, let me change this up here. There's that part of it, too. Oh, okay, this is the other side of it. Thank you again, Miss Kendra. <laughs> Okay, here we go. 
Thank you, Shelly. He's with his daughters now, Staten Island. He says he's going to retire his sister. Joe's husband. Hey, Greg. Thank you, Miss Sherry, so very much. Thank you, I think my best. He doesn't have a win, but I have a cocktail jacket. He doesn't have an ambition. Certainly not for goals. I say we hit back and take Zaza out. Thank you all very much. Just when I thought I was out, they pulled me back in.
Why did you do this? Stop asking so many fucking questions. Where are we going? Interesting. Very, very interesting. So I do now see who is responsible for, completely responsible for this. I, I've been getting, okay, this is coming from down the rabbit hole. Huh? This is coming from down the rabbit hole. I'm getting deep messages as we speak from her phone number. I will read them and show them to you. This is fucking insane. And I am contacting the police right now. Wow. This, is, this is sick, scary, and disgusting. I'm fucking scared for my family at this point. No. Somebody, she went on finder.com, has me, some name that I don't even know, is throwing my addresses that I used to rent at me, uh, and that there's more, tell the effing truth, okay? Wow. Showing my old addresses that I used to rent, saying that I own properties, I've never owned a, a, a home in my life. Tell the effing truth now. I have everything mf -er. Tell them uh, you do not deserve those hearts. I have it all. I said, I just told the truth. You're a, I'm a sick liar. How am I lying? No, there's a lot more. Explain that, please. A, a lot. You want? No wonder you wanted me gone. I didn't want her to be gone. A lot of other people were complaining right. because she was, they were afraid of the things she was saying. Now she's saying, who owns it, Joe? And how the F would you be legit owned by Rory? Excuse me? No. She. Wow. You were owned by Rory? That's hilarious. She said, sure. let me up. Please do. No, I'm calling the police right now and showing yeah. all of this. This is insane. I've never owned a home in my life. I I'm embarrassed to say that, but I'm trying to own hey. this one. No, this is down the rabbit hole. That's who this is, which is probably why No Chain said what she said, because she went and told her that. Mm -hmm. No, and then said that there was, who cleaned it up? Do you what? want the list of everyone who surrounds your homes? These are threats. This is, I'm done with this shit. Yeah, call the cops. I know what your name is, or whoever this is. I thought this was down the rabbit hole. Maybe I'm wrong. I got so many emails and, and messages from people. I don't know who the fuck this is. Excuse my language. But I'm pretty sure that this is. This is who that is. That's who she said she was. Wow.
No, he needs to let the live go and call the cops and take care of his family. He doesn't need to wait and do it in the morning. He needs to I'm take sorry. Truth is in the rabbit hole. That's who this is. She's stating. Yeah. Well, okay. So sorry. We said your name wrong. Everybody knows who you are. Who is Mr. Girl? She said, Dago, you wouldn't believe what's going on on certain YouTube channels. I've been monitoring one in particular. They're working to get you up YouTube. For what? And who's they? Yeah, I know. That's why I've ignored all of that stuff about the Rory thing. We should talk. See, this is what this is about. Because I would not play into the whole thing that she was sending me all that stuff. No, I don't. If I'm not getting involved in other people's issues. I'm not going to go accusing people of things when I don't have yeah. proof of it. So please don't say other creators' names, guys. Yeah, like I said, don't, don't, don't go after anybody. Okay, I'm sure it has something to do with a specific one. I don't, whatever. Okay, but again. I have never been doing that. Yes, you have been doing that. Now you're threatening me, my family, and everybody around me because hey, of guys, things that you're making stop up. Saying other yeah, creators. You just threatened my every witness. Everybody witnessed it. I showed it to them. That's threatening me and my family. No, Gigi, I didn't have a falling out with um, Rory. I just stepped away because of the drama that was over there. There was a lot of drama going on with other, you know, TikTokers and stuff like that. And I stepped away from it because I will not talk about anything that I don't have concrete proof about. You guys know that. I can't. Right. You can't do stuff like that, okay? You can't just throw out information about people when you don't have it. You can't say, this is what I think. You, you can't do that. It's wrong. OK, it's bad enough, you know, that with the things I've said, the theories that I've come up with thinking about it all. But I can't say I can't put people's names out there without proof of things. You can't do that. I would never harm you. What do you think you're doing with all of this? I'm not trying to play a game. You guys see this coming through my phone as I'm speaking. Mm hmm. I would never harm you. I'm not threatening you. What do you call all of this? Yeah, seems like a threat to me. Yeah, well, I can't do it anymore. I've been nice about this. I've been polite about this. They're coming from truth is in the rabbit hole. I believe that's to say it correctly. Susan, whatever her name is. I was very nice and polite to her. I listened to everything she said to me. I could not go out with any of the information. And I was told not to by her multiple times because she's telling me she's scared. She's telling me that Rory's this person, that Kim is that person, blah, 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 blah. I'm not going to do that type of thing, okay? I can't. Nobody can. Oh, you would never threaten me or support that. But you're doing it now. Yep. You you can't turn your story around now, okay? Now she and then earlier here up here, how many twelve year olds were there? Uh, you know, victims of but with my son, hmm. who helped clean that up? What is this all? I don't understand any of this anymore. This is insane. Yeah, you need to call the police. My wife is has had almost had a nervous breakdown. My son, my 17-year-old son has been crying on and off all day because he's already upset because of what his brother did. He knows that, you know, we didn't hide it from him because he's old enough to understand why his brother's exactly, not around. Exactly, Sandra. Around. You know, I hadn't seen the kid in three years before this happened. So I don't know anything about what he did other than I told him to, he had to go away from me because of his drug problem. I can't support that. She sat in our Discord and doxed Rory. There's footprints of it, so... I told the truth. Everything I said was true. As far as I know, there's no other truth to tell. 
Yep. Tell them that, you know, I she's hear- blackmailing you, intimidation, harassment, doxing. You can get her on all that. Well, I have it all right here. And yes, she has. That is a threat as far as I'm concerned. And I have how many witnesses to this? Okay. There is no other truth to tell. I don't know anything else about it. That's what I know. Just because he's my child does not mean that I know anything about his personal life. Yep. If I do not know, you should call me privately. No, 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 no. I know what he did. It was on the news, for Christ's sakes. If there was more, it would have been on the news. Mm -hmm. Okay? You don't deserve a phone call from me after what you've done to me. Yep, stalking. Anyway, I'm sorry you guys had to see this. This is so disgusting. You know, you no, got your salty. point. You, you, you got you got what you wanted, okay, Susan. You, you hurt me for for whatever reason. Just because I wouldn't take your information and go li- live with it, you hurt me. You happy? There you go. Thank you. I know, Leslie. I know. We're all upset for Dago. I'm so sorry, you guys. You don't deserve any of this. None of this. None of it. I I, I just I don't Turquoise, even know we don't talk like that in here, hun. Come on. No, don't do that, Turquoise, please. That's not right. Either way. That's what I'm saying, Mike. You can't go live with stuff like that because if you accuse people of things without having any kind of proof, that's a lawsuit. That's jail time. That's anything you could... It's dangerous. So that is a threat. So just because I didn't do that, this is all about... You're going to go dox me for where I used to live. I'll tell you where I lived. No, it was absolutely your doing. I know where it came from. I was told where it came from. So don't 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 tell lies about it now. And you do it's want okay, to hurt me. Course. You did hurt me. It, it's it's there. Okay. You're not taking the fall for anyone. Okay. You're you're you and the you are other- a grown adult. You know right from wrong in rabbit, and you did wrong. You're going. You're going. Pay for it. I'm. I will be doing that. It's. It's. It's done. I can't. And I'm not even. It was not. I'm not a liar. Okay. You just said a whole bunch of lies. There is nothing else that was put out there in the news. None of this ever. Okay. And again, anything that was there. There isn't. There is nothing else. This is the whole reason why people asked me to remove her from the Discord, okay? Because they were afraid of the things that she does. Had nothing to do with me wanting her gone. Yeah, it's none of her business to begin with. None of it is, but whatever. They've made it their business, so be it. I could do the same thing. I could go digging on people and and find all their family dirt or whatever they've had going in their lives and blast it all over YouTube. Who does right? stuff like that? We know quite a bit about Rabbit's past. We could blast it too, but we're not. But I don't do that. Because... I, I actually felt bad for her, for the things that she had gone through in her past. Exactly. Once again, they go the nice guy that, yeah, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. What did you say, Doodle? This, as a police officer for 19 years, this is a crime and you need a protection order. I did not intend for you to feel this way or feel. What? Okay, when you. How did you think he was going to feel? 
I didn't. No wonder you wanted me gone. I have gone. I have all the truth. I have everything. Motherfucker. Excuse my language, folks. Uh. Okay. Tell them you do not deserve those hearts. I'm a sick liar. No wonder you wanted me gone. Tell the effing truth now. I could have just done that the first time. I'm sorry. How dare you, you use and lie. Did you say how many 12-year-olds? No, there was one victim in that case it, that I've ever heard of. So that's a lie. You want the list of who owns your properties. That's, that's, that's stalking, okay? Yeah, yeah. You need to hop off here and... We need to end this, and you need to call the cops. Get a protection okay. order. Once again, everybody, I am so, so, so sorry from the deepest depths of my heart that you had to see and hear all of this. This is probably going to end up being privated because YouTube's going to take it down anyway. Right. Um, <clears throat> Security. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I think that Mandy, I love you so very much. Right. <laughs> I really do, Mandy. I absolutely adore you. I appreciate all of your support more than you know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I probably will save it at first, at least for evidence. Um, And anybody that is in Discord, I will be in there shortly after I handle what I have to handle. And I'll talk about this a little different, okay? I will need to go to bed, but I will talk to you. I know, I know. And I, you know, listen, you're here way longer than you should have been, and I'm so sorry. Yeah. Oh, I it's fine. I appreciate it. I lasted longer than I thought I did, would. <laughs> but I'm glad I stayed, though. Because... Got yeah, I know, right. Daisy. I know. She cried in the Discord. Everybody supported her. Everybody felt bad for her. I felt bad for her. I, I did phone calls with her, late night phone calls, trying to help her to feel normal, to feel good about, better about the things she was dealing with. And it, it got too much. Okay? The, the, the amount of it scared me. My wife even was scared. She's like, you have to stop. Like, get away from that, you know? So, whatever. Hopefully, I will see you all tomorrow. Um, and hopefully, it'll be the normal time during the day. I'm sorry about all of this. More than I can ever explain to you in words, folks. I love you all beyond the word. The word don't even exist. And I hope everybody has a wonderful night. I hope everybody has... Just have a wonderful night, folks. Don't forget to love yourselves and to love each other. And don't change a thing about yourselves. You guys are beautiful. I love you so very much. And I'll see you all so very soon. Have a great night. Bye-bye. Night, guys. Thanks for supporting us. We'll see you later. Love y'all. Why won't it end? Ghost. <laughs>